forward if we use my power to so. Watch out for electrified. You won't be able to move if you're electrified. Thanks, I'll take it. That was close. Okay. Nice. Close. My fault.
I need your help. Good attack. 
It doesn't look like they're storing data anywhere. I don't even see anything resembling research equipment. I think the facility is underground, but there weren't any stairs leading down from the first floor. We'll just have to comb the area ourselves. If this is where they conducted his personality rehabilitation, Nagi's data should be here. I wonder if Nagi managed to get away. I had all of you there to rescue me, but he was alone. You're still as kind as ever. Nagi! You did come back. Of course you did. I mean, we're best friends, aren't we? Looks like Nagi received even more personality rehabilitation. Because Nagi was regaining his original personality the last time we saw him? Personality rehabilitation? You traitors against glorious new Himuka are the ones who need rehabilitation, not me! 
There's no need to worry, Yuito. They specifically told me you need to be alive when I bring you in! Stop it, Nagi! I don't want to fight you! Then come with me! We wouldn't have to fight them. Of course, I'll kill anyone else who gets in my way. So what's it gonna be? I didn't know Nagi could fight this one. If we don't use SAS, we don't have a chance. Don't let the personality rehabilitation control you, Navi. You can tell he's your friend. That's why I'm doing this. I'm steering my friend to the right path. Watch the enemy. I've seen a lot of people whose personalities suddenly changed like that. I should have started investigating earlier. If you did, you would have been personality rehabilitated too. Let's do our best to stop him for now. Too bad for you, I'm not done yet! Yeah! <laughs> Guys! <sighs> you in tow! Yuito, I know that was scary. They're all done with the tests now. Honest. Let me see that brave face. You're okay. It's all over. Mommy! Dream? About my mom? Why would I have that now? 
Oh, right. This ceiling. It looks like the hospital room from when I was a kid. The smell, too. Smell. Where am I? <sighs> huh? I can't use my powers? You can't use your powers here. Those restraints are designed to nullify your abilities. You're such a fool. All you had to do was play the patriotic hero, and you would have had the world on a platter. Who are you? Just a humble staff member of this facility. We've met a number of times when you were a child, but I'm sure you don't remember. We did? Have you forgotten about your time here in the hospital with your mother? Which means this is still somewhere inside the old OSF hospital. Where are my friends? No idea. Your friends are outside my jurisdiction. I'm in charge of duds. You mean people without powers? That's right. I was in charge of the experiments involving you and the Travers brothers. Unlike Karin and Luca, it seems like your psionic hormone levels are dropping. What? Now that I think about it, your psychokinesis was activated under some unconventional circumstances. Duds have an extremely low chance of manifesting powers in the first place. This could mean there's something special about your cerebrum. I'd like to ask you a few questions. Wait, I'm a dud? Oh. So you're missing your memories from when you were a dud, too. This is going to be tricky. It seems your brain is accumulating damage as you use your power. I need to run some tests before I ask you any questions. I'm sure you've experienced episodes of sudden memory loss or having difficulty remembering your childhood. Wait! Please, explain it to me so I can understand. <sighs> it's simple. You were born a dud. Then you were hospitalized here with your mother, because this was still the OSF hospital at that time. We know that duds are capable of acquiring potent powers. The country sends all duds to this hospital, where we run medical experiments on them. I'm a dud? I had no powers? In any case, it's time to go back to sleep. <sighs> Damn it! I can't stay awake. Yuito! Are you all right? Major General Fubuki? How? The program he gave us was able to tap into the facility's surveillance camera feed. I knew it would be dangerous infiltrating this place. I made sure I would be available if something happened. Thank you very much. I'm glad you guys are all right. I'm sorry, Major General. We couldn't get Nagi's memory data. Uh, right, Nagi. What happened after that? You suddenly collapsed, and Nagi... He took you, and then used you as... as a hostage. We were afraid of hurting you, so we couldn't attack him. We were locked inside a room. There was strange equipment. I think it was for personality rehabilitation. The Major General Fubuki showed up before any of us were rehabilitated, so we're all okay. You don't have to worry about us. Sorry. You're always rescuing me. Thanks, guys. Wait. It looks like others are gathering. I've disconnected the alarm, but they should already know Yuito's trying to get away. We have to escape the hospital. I've already shared the way out with Wataru. I'll hold them off here. But... Don't forget, I'm a Septentrion. I can handle myself. Take this. Don't lose it. No matter what. What is it? I'll tell you when we get out of here. Now go. You'll only get in my way. Okay. I don't see any safe area near here for teleporting. We have to run. Got it. Please, be careful. I had no power. I was a dud. I'm more confused than shocked. It's too much to take in. Next. Yes. Nagi must have attacked Yuito under orders from the new Himuka government. 
We should consider him as being completely under the government's control. I can't escape this way. 